Well, hello everyone, Jeff here with my new RipRap 3D printer. I finished building it. All I need to do now is download software, put it on a computer, and do all the calibrations. Show you a little bit of what I've done, have done. I need to clean up the power supply wiring. I'll probably take it apart and cut the wires back. And then I noticed, uh, or notice I put the uh, ramps, mounted them on a plastic triangular base, and the power supply. It made for a a good build and held everything up to where you can carry it in one piece. show you a little something that I didn't know was going to happen but uh, this motor stepper motor is acting like a generator when I move this uh, plate back and forth the LEDs start lighting up all three of them for the uh, end stops it's interesting that either way it'll light them up Just a little something I learned. <clears throat> then I got my my hot end finished completely. I still have to test it to see if it's going to work. Go around the back here. All the wiring up secured. Arduino, all the wiring, and then the, the end stop. I built the end stops out of just parts that I had. Pretty interesting to me, anyway. I put knobs on some of the motors so I could turn them easily, like the Z axis. So now I don't have it hooked up to the computer or anything, but I'm going to go ahead and power it up. This is the way my LEDs are going to be until I put transistors in the circuit to make them off at this point. And then when it, when the, <coughs> when the little flag hits the end stop then it will turn it off or turn turn the LED on I got them just backwards which is alright it's not going to hurt anything it turns it off right now it goes high when it's like this and it's low when the LED is on I just have to tweak the software, I think. I sort of like the LEDs on, actually. And I haven't figured out what the red flashing light is. It might have to do with the software trying to uh, find the software or something. I don't know yet. I'll figure it out. You can see a little green LED on the Arduino and the flashing on the ramps. 1.4 board.
Well, as I said, I'll have to uh, download the software <coughs> and load the computer. I still have to uh, repair my laptop so I can use it, which is no big deal. But this is where I'm at, and uh, I'll update some more later on. Thank you for watching. This is Jeff signing off. Bye.